This episode of Hunting Hot Seat is brought to you by Traditions. Feel the difference, see the performance. Today's question comes to us from Brett in Arkansas and he writes, does it take more skill to be a stand hunter or a stalk hunter? And which one represents the greater achievement when it's pulled off? Let's see what our experts have to say. You know, in my opinion, getting on the ground with a deer and mixing it up with him is the ultimate whitetail hunting experience, and it's tough. But I have to tell you, it's not as easy hunting from a stand as people want to make like it is, is it? The placement of your stand is critical for success. And especially when you go to a piece of property that doesn't already have a stand, you have to go out there and sort it out. Where do I put this stand for the best odds? And they don't appreciate the managers like yourself. You set these stands up, they get the stand, but you've already done the heavy I've lifting. Done the homework. You right. have. There's skill in both. And when you go up against a mature whitetail, you better be armed with skill and knowledge or you're going to come home empty. I don't care whether you hunt from a stand or on the ground. For more discussion on this topic, join us on techamoney.com. Yeah, Brad, I would have to agree. They're both an accomplishment, but when you can take a deer from the ground right there eye to eye with him, it's hard to beat that. And thanks so much for riding the Bucks of Tecamati. This episode of Hunting Hot Seat is brought to you by Traditions. Feel the difference, see the performance. Go to tecamati.com for the extended Hunting Hot Seat segment.